stuff to do and I'm just gonna do it today so I just get it done and over with and just power through it. I'm sorry the wash the dishwasher is running and the washer is running because we I just did dishes and laundry so I'm sorry the baby's sleeping I planned on this morning literally getting up eating breakfast getting dressed and then going but I was by the time I finished getting dressed she was ready to go to sleep for an hour. I don't know. I'm pretty sure she's going through a sleep regression, which really sucks because she just got over being sick. She's still kind of in the sick phase, but she's like in the end of it where she's like not sick anymore, but she's still really clingy. So on top of that, with the sleep regression, it sucks because she's not wanting to sleep. So when she was ready for a nap, I was like, you're going that nap I guess I guess we're just gonna wait so hopefully she wakes up soon at 12 35 I guess that's that that's the intro to this vlog hello how's everybody doing I guess I could show you guys what I what we got her for Christmas while she's sleeping I do need to wrap I haven't wrapped anything I literally have to get like basically everybody in my family like one more gift probably not even everybody like I have to get like five more things and that's it I'm I feel pretty proud of myself because by this time last year we had nothing or like half of the stuff we have we're basically done the last things I have to get are like just small little things that I just want to get but I do have to get my parents a big present <laughs> They already know what they're getting, so if they watch this vlog, it's fine. But I do have to get to that. It's the only like big present I get. All the other stuff I have to get today is just like little things. And I do have to find stocking stuffers for Ethan and the baby. I already know what I'm gonna get, but it's really hard finding something for babies. Like, what do you put in their stocking? I have like little mini wooden cars to put in there, but. I don't really know, so that's the plan. We have to go to Walmart first to get the big present for my parents. If it's there, last night I looked there, said it was there, so try to look again to make sure it's still there before I go there, and it's not. Um, and then I really want to go to TJ Maxx. I've been to TJ Maxx in a really long time. TJ Maxx is supposed to be twice as better than Marshalls, and I literally love Marshalls. So, honestly, I'm just going to travel a lot to go to TJ Maxx. <laughs> That's the dishwasher. <laughs> but yeah, I'll update you guys in a little bit. There's like nothing here and I totally think I'm gonna pick her up a couple more things today. Um, we did already gift her her big Christmas present that we were getting her which is the nugget which is right here. She plays with it every single day and she literally loves it. It was the best investment ever. If you know what the nugget is you know that it's very expensive so it was an investment. So we weren't planning on getting her much especially because she's gonna get a lot from her other grandparents and like aunts and uncles and stuff like that. So. I really didn't want to get much um, but now that I'm looking at it I feel like I didn't get like anything so now I'm definitely gonna go back and get her more stuff the other I wouldn't say like big ticketed item because it's really not that expensive um, but is her balance board it comes in this like cute little bag I'm not gonna wrap this um, 
just because for one it's really hard to wrap and I'll just put it in a black thing and she can open it and whatever um but yeah it is a balance board I mean it's really self-explanatory it's a balance board they balance on it um I got the one with the felt side on one and then nothing on the other just because I thought it would be nice and you know I don't know and then we got her this Melissa and Doug ice cream set. She loves playing with her kitchen and all of her little food. She actually doesn't have any food for it. She only has like pots and pans and stuff like that. So I really, that's one thing I really like encourage everybody to get her was food um, because that's the one thing that she doesn't have. So of course, I got her this and we love Melissa and Doug around here so I also did get her like a pizza one the Melissa and Doug pizza one but I opened it and it had like felt stuff in it and I really didn't like it because she has felt ones here that she doesn't play with she doesn't like them so I'm actually going to give that to somebody else and I ended up finding another pizza one by Melissa and Doug it was different on the marketplace but it wasn't in like a box like this or packaged up but it was brand new um the guy said that her his daughter like never played with it so i got it and i literally got it for five dollars so i did already give that to her so that was another christmas present but yeah and then i got her the hedgehog linkamole um honestly now that i'm thinking about it i wish i didn't because she really doesn't play with her linkamoles that she has now she has almost all the Linkamoles. She's missing like three, including this one. Um, but the Linkamoles is the one thing that I am keeping because like a lot of her toys, as she grows out of them, we will donate. Um, the Linkamoles is the one thing that I'm keeping for like every baby that I have. So I guess we just added to the collection. I love the Linkamoles. I think they're literally the cutest and they're so fun. She does play with them sometimes, but it's not the first thing that she like goes to and then I got her a little purse it it like I guess is Mickey Mouse but I didn't get it for the Disney reason I got it just because this is this was the only one that I could find that was small enough for her that was pink it was kind of cute and was a decent price because like there was stuff on there that was this small and it was literally like $20 I'm sorry it's for a baby she's literally gonna probably ruin it but she likes to carry around stuff, so I got her that because why the heck not? That's that's literally what we got her for things for her to open. That's why I'm saying, like, I really need to go and get something else. For her stocking, we got her a new cup. I got this at all these two. Um, I think it was like four or five dollars, and it's kind of like the ones that she has now that she likes. I actually let her pick it out and she picked this one out. Um, and it says right here that it's leak proof, so it's kind of cool. But it's like kind of the ones that she has now um just a little different and i like this one because it's the holiday one so i thought it was cute so we got that and then we got this from the target dollar spot everybody has this and everybody loves it so i got it for her um it's like the sh little charcuterie set board thing and then these wood cars that i talked about earlier also for her stocking it comes six in a box i got them off of amazon and they look like this they're just little wooden cars, easy for her to grab, super cute. Um, and yeah, these are gonna also go in her stocking too. I'm gonna take them out and just put them in her stocking. She has a pretty decent sized stocking. Okay, so I'm editing and I completely forgot to show Ariel's big gift, like other big gift. We got her the nugget, but we got her another like big gift to open up on Christmas. Um, if you know, I'm redoing like her playroom and her bedroom. I don't think I said her bedroom before, but we are redoing her playroom and her bedroom. So I've been gathering a bunch of stuff. So one of the things I got her are a table. I know people are going to be like a table, really, but, um, she loves this little table at mom's house. She's obviously still going to sit in her high chair whenever, you know, she needs to, but we got her table because... Why the heck not and it was on sale when i got it so i was like whatever i'm just gonna get it so yeah this is her other big present we got her a table and it's gonna go right in the playroom so yeah that's it so yeah that's everything that we got so like i said i definitely think i'm going to try and search for something today um maybe like you know two or three more things for her because a lot of the stuff that i was going to get her i ended up sending to like grandparents and aunts 
to get her which they got her so it's kind of like what else am i supposed to get i definitely think i want to get her some outfits because tj maxx is like really known for their clothes so i might do that so she has that but yeah now we just wait for the baby to wake up because she's in there and she is still sleeping so now i guess we just chill and wait okay we're literally in walmart and you can tell that it's the last weekend before Christmas because, dude, so many people are literally like running around with a chicken with their head cut off. So, so glad I got all my stuff done. What? Oh, thank you. Hey! But there's nothing in there for you. I didn't bring anything in for her, like her juice or any snacks or anything because I plan to just come in and grab. She's just being a brat right now. I'm gonna grab this and get the heck out of here because it's really crazy. Okay, the angle is like horrible because my freaking stupid phone thing sucks. But I just got out of there and literally, why does it have to be so crazy in stores right now? Like literally, it's so freaking crazy. We couldn't get in, in and out of any aisles. Literally, like, it's annoying. They did still have a lot of stuff left though. So I was really surprised because the thing that I got for my parents, um, there was like literally hundreds of them there. So I was really excited that I got that. And it was actually a better deal than it was online. It was like $20 cheaper in the store, so I was really excited for that. Um, but yeah, so we're leaving Walmart, thankfully. Now I'm trying to get the fuck out of here. And we're going to Target, or not Target, why did I say Target? We're going to TJ Maxx, which is like 20 minutes away, so I have to get on the highway. I did stop here on Duncan. I can't do this without Duncan. Okay, we are in the next. Um, I have a whole list of stuff that I have to get. Um, and I was, I was completely wrong. Um, TJ Maxx is way worse than Walmart. Um, but I specifically came into the purse section first because I really wanted to get those mommy and me purses. But they don't have them, so sad. But they did have the hats. The little hat looked too big. So. Okay, I feel like my TJ Maxx shoe section sucks. I really wanted to look for those like smiley face slippers or the like UGG slippers. They don't have any. No, I want to say have. And they're a little too bright and out there for me. Ma'am. The only thing I hate about TJ Maxx is these freaking carts are so tiny. Like, you can't fit anything in it. So she's walking now, which means we're going to be here way longer than I expected. Come on. We're done, honestly. I wouldn't say it was a waste driving all the way here because I did still get like a lot of stuff. Spent $130. But they didn't have what I specifically came here for. The things I was talking to you guys about before was the the purse, the, the purse set. Didn't have it at Marshall's when I went. And everybody said go to TJ Maxx, I would have it there. So I came and they didn't have it. And then the hats, the mini, the mommy and me set hats, they had tons and tons and tons of them. But they, the hat, like the mini hat was like so big. It pretty much could almost fit me. So, and I was paying $25 for it. For her to most likely not even wear it this year, she'll 
won't fit into until probably next year or even the year after. And she has so many hats, so it was pointless to spend money on it for it to just sit there. But anyway, I'm rambling, it's a dark, because obviously it's five o'clock, so it's dark out. But I'll explain more when I get home, because it's dark, I'm driving. I'll see you guys when I get home. Okay, we're home. And it was very eventful. Um, Ariel was not feeling it. And she's not like sick, but she's getting over with being sick. So it was not fun. On top of that, the TJ Maxx carts are like this fucking big. They're so tiny, like you can't fit anything in there. So I had the diaper bag, I had my jacket and I took it off and put them in the cart and then that was it. That's all that could fit in there. And then she was sitting in the top of it. So literally I couldn't put anything in there. So I had to take her out. I ended up having to put my coat back on. I had to carry the diaper bag to fit stuff in there. And then she was running around, running away from me, crying, throwing stuff. So I had to put her back in the cart. And then she screamed even louder and it was the worst. It was the absolute worst. Never again, TJ Maxx, get bigger carts. Because if I had a bigger cart, it would be easier because I could have done it way faster, but I literally just had to keep moving stuff around to fit everything. It was just, it was not fun. <sighs> so we didn't really get anything for Ariel because I didn't, I, I didn't have time to search. Um, I did get uh, a couple things for her, but. So the first thing I got was my parents' carpet shampooer cleaner. I got this one. Um, I don't know anything about carpet cleaners, but they wanted one and I found this one and yeah, it had a dog in it. So I thought it was cute. <laughs> and then this didn't come with it. I'm sure that one does come with a bottle. I mean, I'm assuming it does. It, uh, it has to, but I got them this one too. Um, it's Seabreeze scent, Paws and Claws. So I got them that. This is their big present. And then I have two bags here. First thing I got, I got this for my nephew. Um, I thought it was cool. Cool because it has like a cute dog and my nephew has a dog. So yeah, he said he wanted like army guys. So I found that and I thought it was cool. I figured he would like it. Um, and then the other thing that I got for him was this because he watches this, but I thought he would like it. So got him that and then the last thing I had to get for my niece was a baby because she wanted a baby with a bottle and there wasn't really any cute ones there but I found this one and it comes with a potty too so I got it and I got this it's a hat and a gloves set it's Calvin Klein I got Mossy some uh bags because we needed more <coughs> self-explanatory ariel picked out this toy for mossy i'm gonna put it in her stocking um it's a lavachino and it's for valentine's day i thought it was super cute she doesn't have anything like this so i got that and then we're doing a gift exchange uh for all the little kids at daycare and so this is the gift we got to exchange um it's it's like a baking set it's kind of like the one that ariel has but i comes with a little bit more pieces and i think it might be a little bit bigger but it's the pink one and i got gift boxes there's five in here and it was only 3.99 so i thought it was a good deal i don't need that many boxes but i needed some and then this is the only thing I got for myself there. It's a refreshing cleanser by Differin, which is a really good brand for acne. I use the Adafalene. We're gonna try. And then these are the only two things that I got Ariel because I couldn't really find anything. So I got her this little champion jumpsuit. It's white, it's gonna get dirty. I already know for a fact. Two seconds she has it on and it will be dirty, but I found it and it was only $12.99. So, and I got it in uh, 18 months. And then she picked this out. She got it out and then like was playing with it or trying to play with it. So I was like, I'm just gonna get it. 
And like I said, we love Melissa and Doug. She's getting a lot of these for Christmas, so I really didn't want to get it, but we got it anyway. So that's what we got her. What are you doing? <laughs> yeah. And the last thing we got, um, Ariel picked this out for Ethan. This is his Christmas gift from her. It's a little coffee mug. He loves um, hot chocolate. And we don't have many coffee mugs because I don't drink hot coffee. I drink iced coffee, so I put them in mine. He doesn't drink hot coffee either. So we literally have like three mugs and they're all girly. So, <laughs> are you okay? <laughs> so I let her pick out one because I thought it would be like the perfect present. And this one says the man, the myth, the legend, dad. And I feel like it's pretty decent size. So this is what Ariel got him for Christmas. And that's it. That's everything I got. I did not get as much as I thought. Um, kind of upset about it. Ariel, are you okay now? Because you were not very happy in the store, miss. Yeah. No, oh, this is literally the mess that's on the floor now. And I literally have not wrapped one thing. Whoa. Say whoa. Wow. <laughs> wow. So I'm most definitely going to end the vlog here because there's really nothing left for the rest of the night besides cook dinner. Um, I'm probably going to start wrapping tonight i really don't want to wrap i hate wrapping and then it's like after you wrap everything where do you put it all because right now like you've seen earlier all of our stuff is in the spare bedroom closet but it's just like chucked in there thrown in there so be careful so once it's all wrapped it's like you can't really throw it in bags or like throw it because you don't want to rip the wrapping paper <laughs> i don't know if anybody else has a problem i don't know so we're probably just gonna have to like clear a spot in the third bedroom because we keep her pink car that we got her for her birthday stored in there when she's not using it <sighs> it's gonna be fun is that funny <laughs> you think that's funny ew she's literally putting dog food in ethan's coffee mug hot chocolate mug <laughs> okay so yeah i really hope you guys enjoyed this vlog the next vlog is probably going to or it is going to be our christmas vlog so we won't see you guys until next week when it's christmas um i'm not sure how the christmas vlog is going to go because we celebrate on christmas eve with ethan's family and then on christmas day with my family so i'm most likely gonna do what i did last year and convert both of them in like one vlog so it's not going to be like an all day thing. It's just going to be bits and clips of it. And But yeah. Anyway, I'm just rambling now. So <laughs> don't forget to like this video and subscribe so you don't ever miss any of my future uploads. And yeah, we're going to go and cook dinner. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.